Mama did it. Wait. All done. All done. All done. All done. Go more. You want more? More? This is help. Help, it looks like help. Look, eat, eat, drink, drink, milk, milk, more, all done, water, please, thank you, sorry, bath, bath, and sleep, sleep. Yeah, we could have learned those. Where did your beans go? Okay. Oh, man. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right. Like I said, all done. All done. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our vlog. Today, apparently a cold front came in, so it's cold outside. Um, so I'm going to take Lily out there and see how she feels about it. It's probably a little bit warmer. Whoa. It's probably a little warmer now than it was when we woke up this morning. She woke up in such a happy mood. Um, cause she actually slept for once. Oh, it is chilly. <gasps> Look how chilly it is. Oh, it's so cold. She loves coming outside. It's like her favorite thing, but I don't have shoes on for this. Come on. We are actually flying to North Carolina for Mauricio's birthday, which is in October. October 13th is when we leave, and it's supposed to be pretty cold up there. It's in the mountains. My mom lives in the mountains. So I've been getting her warmer clothes for there. Um, I've been getting her warmer clothes for there, but I also knew that it gets cold here. so. I know she can use them. It's not like I've spent tons of money on clothes that she's gonna wear for one week and then we're gonna have to like put up. She definitely will be able to wear them here. I'm just doing probably like a lot of layers up there, if that makes sense, like a long sleeve onesie, pants, a jacket, and then I have like a winter jacket for her for up there in case it gets really cold. I have mittens and hats and stuff like that. So we should be good to go on that, but I do need to get her some warmer jammies. All of her jammies are like the bamboo material um, or like this super light cotton material that's pretty popular around baby clothes, especially like if you get them from Walmart, or Target, TJ Maxx, whatever. Um, you can't keep doing that. I need the clip. But yeah, we need to get some warmer jammies for her. Mauricio's at work right now. He's doing a test. Um, so he'll be home later this morning and then have to go back to work this afternoon. But it's just me and Lilybug. Like always, it's always just me and Lilybug most of the time. We were gonna take family pictures this weekend, but the sunflower field is not blossomed, so we can't do that. We have to wait another week, which makes me sad, but I do wanna find something to do outdoors this weekend. I'm just not sure what I wanna do yet. I don't know. I really wanna take her to like the zoo or like an aquarium or something that she can like look at stuff with. Even like a, I wish we had like a children's museum around us. I know she's young and she can't like move around but she loves to look at stuff and she loves to reach out and grab stuff and feel for things. So like, I think even though she's still too young for a children's museum, I think she would still like, it would be fun for her. <laughs> Be back. She was a hungies girl. She has like a bald spot on the back of her head. <laughs> He's so cute. But I'm about to put her in her carrier. And my carrier is literally the most asked question I get everywhere. Where is it from? How much is it? Do you like it? Do you love it? So I'm gonna show you guys how I put it on. It's really easy to put on, and then I'll talk about it a little bit here. Um, but I have a highlight on Instagram that talks more about it. Um, in specific when I first got it I opened it up on Instagram so there's a highlight that says baby Bjorn on my Instagram if you want to check that out this is the OO TV every day I look like this this these shirts are destroyed I've had these pants for I have no idea how long and 
I don't wear a bra because it's easier to feed my baby that way. So, this is just always how I look. Always. Yeah, she agrees. So, this has, um, what I really like about it is that this does not come unclipped, so it always stays like this, and I really like that. Some people might not like it. Um, you can adjust it, though, so you know you can make it looser, tighter, whatever you need to. So you just take it. The arm straps are like this. They are also attached. You just put your arms in. You put your head in, and then it's pretty much almost done. Um, so then it has like a waist belt. Right here, it's like a super long waist belt. It goes around the waist and it snaps kind of like a, I don't even know what kind of clip this is, but it kind of just like, hopefully you can see that, um, snaps in. This is a European style um, or a European brand baby carrier. So it definitely has different clips than like an American one. But this is what I said. It was the Baby Bjorn. And it, this is like the one, if I want to say it's the one. It's not the small one. So there's one that's like $99. And that's like good for like them up until like 20 pounds. I think this one's good till 33 pounds. So it's like the next one. And this one's like 180. And I was able to use um, the Bye Bye Baby 20% off. So I recommend doing that if you were interested in this this is the leopard print which goes out of stock very quickly um i had a struggle i had i had trouble finding it so if it's in stock right now like you're lucky if you wanted to grab it i would definitely grab it um so i show all these different parts on instagram so i'll leave that to the instagram story but i'm putting her in facing me so that she can take a little nap See, grab the little stinky dew. The full, fat, happy, stinky dew. So we'll hold her booty. This goes up and over. We can take the legs, drop them out. And this is all already adjusted to her. And then these straps just like slide in. And then this one wraps around. And you can see what kind of clips they are. Like, <laughs> They're definitely not like traditional snaps like we used, like to use in America. So there's those. And then this top one. If she will let me show you guys. Move your hand, please. All right, so now she's in securely. You can, this right here is what you use to pull to make them closer. You should always be able to kiss your baby's head when they're in carriers. Um, so you just pull that and do that. I end up tying mine like this just to get them out of the way. Okay, okay. And you can adjust the strap here. Um, oh, it's on the side. A strap this side and you can uh, put it in this little, uh, what is this called, loop? To keep this one out of the way as well so that's the carrier i really like this carrier because it's um facing me facing out and she can be in a backpack eventually it's like a backpack style and i also really like it because oh my gosh your hair girlfriend because um whenever we're out in public People can't really see her in this if she's sleeping. So I really like that people can't get close to her. So if she's sleeping, she's usually here. And this thing is so big and bulky, it's really hard to see her. If you're trying to look at her, you really have to go out of your way and then I will I will move again. So you have to go. So you can't come near my baby. It's different times, don't come near my baby. <laughs> but that's our carrier. This is the baby Bjorn. Where's the logo? Right there. Um, I will link it down below for you guys if you want to check it out. But again, it is an expensive carrier. Most carriers are expensive. I should do a video because I have a bunch of different carriers and they're all different price ranges and there's pros and cons to all of them. So maybe I'll make a YouTube video and sit down with all my very baby carriers I have. I do really want to try a ring sling though. Um, I think that would be comfortable too for her. But we'll just have to wait and see um, if that is something that... 
I would like or if it's just like something that I see on social media and looks nice but it's not very fitting for my lifestyle I guess and how I wear her but yeah this is our carrier I'm gonna try to get her to nap and then I'll be back I just gonna get a venti ice cold brew coffee with vanilla, vanilla and yeah. oat milk mm -hmm. and sweet cream cold foam for sure okay Phew. vanilla oat milk and we can cold Absolutely. What else can I do for you? Can I get the uh, uh, Grande Pumpkin Cold Brew? Mm -hmm. And that's it. And is that going to be all? Yes, ma'am. Okay, for sure. It's going to be 1070 at the window. Perfect. Thank you. Got it. And then now she's going to be like, oh shit, oat milk, vanilla, and cold foam. Fuck, what else? I was like, that's just Grande Pumpkin. Done. A Grande Pumpkin what? Cold Brew. You just said Grande Pumpkin though. You know, rounded pumpkin cold brew. I don't, I don't Starbucks anymore. Okay, Mauricio thinks my order is difficult from Starbucks. It's a cold brew with vanilla and oat milk and vanilla sweet cream cold foam. It's not that hard. I mean, it's more complex than like a grande pumpkin cold brew, whatever. But it's not that difficult. Like, I mean, we've worked at Starbucks where people come in and say they want a venti. Uh, espresso frappuccino with five ristretto shots made with soy milk extra ice in a trenta cup that's what you sound like though that's not what i sound like oh my god what do you guys order from starbucks do you guys order like just something like on the menu like a grande white mocha or like a grande ice white mocha or do you like modify your drinks i feel like a lot of people modify their drinks i can't be the only my favorite one. thing to do i actually know i'm not the only one because i worked here for three four years i need 70 cents but I was like, you earned it. Five cents, keep the change. Okay, so this is what I order. You guys, if it will focus, do you guys see that? It's not that complicated. Yes it is. Oh, the sweet, the cold foam is really good today. Anyways, we're out getting Lilia diapers. Um, We're almost out of them. Maybe this is like more. the first time we've almost been out of diapers in a while we've always like had like a stash but now like we're like low on diapers so going to walmart to grab those and then probably you know buy a million other things from walmart so we got back from walmart and we got something really fun for the house for halloween growing up my dad loved halloween and would decorate the house for halloween so it's really it's special to me to decorate our house for halloween um and christmas eventually but i wonder if we have an outlet i don't think we do i'm just gonna see if i can blow it up right here Dixie, inside inside Yes. With those beautiful blue eyes. Look what look what that is. What is it? What is that? <laughs> She's like, I don't know, it looks sketchy. Oh shoot. Oh no, it's like tipped over. <laughs> oh <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> this thing is huge. It's so cool. Oh my gosh, I love it.
that up but now Mauricio is at work and I desperately need to get some chores done um Lily just woke up from a nap and she is like playing in the living room so this is what we're working with I've got a full trash can I've got clean dishes I don't even know I don't even know dirty 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 horrible honestly horrible I'm even embarrassed to show it but I know it looks horrible but it's the reality so I'm gonna clean it up real quick and then I'm just gonna show you guys what it looks like after because I don't know I just don't feel like showing you guys the cleaning again I got it mostly done the only thing I didn't finish was his little cast iron um, I don't know how to clean those every time I clean them I desanitize them so I'm our de season them so I'm just not gonna do it I'm just not gonna do it why is this camera not focusing there we go I look a mess hot mess I put the baby to bed and now I'm just gonna hang out until Mauricio gets home from work um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and end the video here I hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you guys in our next one bye guys so I just close my